Good morning. Good morning, everyone. It's just construction out there on the roads at this hour getting in the way. Uh, 95 North on the express lanes are closed from exit 70 to 72 with construction. So if you're headed to the GW Bridge, you'll need to stick with the local lanes through this area. But once you get to it, uh, there is construction on the span in both directions. So you can see at one point just one lane getting by on that inbound upper level. It's causing just a bit of a delay. So leave yourself some extra time and just keep in mind also that the inbound Holland Tunnel is closed until 5 a.m. with construction. Darlene, back to you. All right, thanks so much, Lauren. 402 right now, New Jersey. Just a reminder, no subway service overnight. They are still being cleaned, so we'll see service restored at 5 a.m. And if you're getting on the major commuter rail line, so far so good, but NJCL. Here's the link in Maria. Good morning, everyone. Uh, most of the roadways are clear, but there are. So, Patterson Plank Road is closed northbound out. Break. So, Patterson Plank Road is closed northbound out by. Yeah. I'll keep you posted. Hopefully, they'll get that reopened. Uh, over on 95 northbound, the express lanes are shut down with construction from exit 70 to 72. So if you're heading towards the George Washington Bridge, you will have to take the local lanes. But once you get there, uh, right now, things are extremely slow going as they're clearing. Uh, so things are quite jammed up on the inbound Holland Good morning, everyone. Uh, construction out there is causing some delays on the roads. Right now, things are moving along pretty nicely on the Alexander Hamilton Bridge, but I have seen sporadic backups. It's all because of the construction at the George Washington Bridge, which is causing an inbound delay right now. Uh, heading over to the trains, no subway service until 5 a.m., but all of your major commuter rail lines are running on or close to schedule. Darlene and Michael, back to you. Thanks so much. Lauren 426 right now still ahead. A major milestone for Connecticut schools as they adjust during the pandemic, plus this. Good morning, everyone. Traffic's not too bad. Uh, there are a couple of issues out there, including a water main break. So repairs to that uh, shut down northbound Patterson Plank Road out by Murray Hill Parkway. So I'll let you know. Uh, thanks, Maria. Good morning. Uh, things are moving along nicely. Patterson Plank Road northbound. Uh, one lane is now blocked. Earlier it was closed because of a water main break, so you can now get through. That's out by Murray Hill Parkway. Heading over to the Alexander Hamilton Bridge. Construction cleared. The delays eased out. You can see things moving along nicely on the Major Deegan beneath it. And then heading over to the rails. Everything's on or close to schedule so far. NJ Transit Commuters North Jersey Coastline still has that modified schedule in effect. And subway service will be restored in just a few minutes. Darlene, back to you. Lauren, thanks so much. 455 right now. Regulators. Towards for Tots, because I just did a story with yes. uh, Salvation Army. And, you know, they just said their need is up 150%. So many people are out of jobs. Right. So many people face eviction. And, and the parents and guardians don't have money for toys. And holidays gifts. are still going to happen, right? So, holidays you know, we want to help these families be ready, right, so that Santa can come to everyone. Absolutely. It's 4.57 right now on this Wednesday morning. Thursday morning? Thursday morning. Thursday morning. All right. Still to come, the steps being taken after dozens of employees test positive at two New Jersey hospitals. Plus this bridge from exit 70 to 72 so you'll have to stick with the local lanes then heading over to the holland tunnel so most of the construction is cleared that's what's really still out there that inbound tube reopen uh, and everything looks good if you now need to head from new jersey into new york via the holland tunnel darlene back to you lauren thank you cases are continuing to soar in new jersey and now some hospitals are struggling with cases among staff in addition to patients trains uh, if you're getting on the major commuter rail lines so far so good north jersey coastline commuters just a reminder you're on a modified schedule this week let's take a live look outside at the roads uh, media it was looking scrawny according to some of the photos but we had faith right yeah, we I, said I think it's, give right. it a minute let's unwrap the tree you know it was like one bad angle and we've all <laughs> been there oh right? my <laughs> god exactly have we been have we ever oh, yeah. maria good morning everyone uh really not too much going on out there there is still construction
at 70 to 72. That's supposed to wrap up by 6 a.m. So I will keep you posted. Heading outside, though, the roads are in great shape. We'll take a live look at the Cross Bronx Express. Good morning, Lauren. Good morning, Maria. Good morning, everyone. Uh, really not too much going on out there. There is still construction that shuts down the northbound express lanes. If you're headed to the GW Bridge from exit 70 to 72, that's supposed to wrap up by 6 a.m. So I will keep you posted. Heading outside, though, the roads are in great shape. We'll take a live look at the Cross Bronx Expressway where there's plenty of people out there.